hello everybody welcome back i hope you're doing well i hope you're having a wonderful day i am for a multitude of reasons that i'm going to share with you first being at 10 a.m this morning the maintenance guy came to my apartment and he fixed my shower for those of you who don't know i don't know why you would but if you did my shower has not been draining properly it started out as just a simple issue it wasn't draining very quickly but you know it would drain by the end last night i showered in like two inches of standing water the like little lip to like keep the water in is like two and a half inches so i was really flirting with disaster there but it was just disgusting and he's my hero and now i took a shower i washed my hair i didn't wash my hair in like six days because i couldn't spend that much time in the shower it would just overflow so it's the little things and i'm very very grateful for my maintenance friend for fixing that for me what else? I had some delicious tacos for dinner. I have a love-hate relationship with tempeh. I used to love it, then I hated it, and now we're rekindling our relationship, and I'm super stoked about it. I used some taco seasoning and some leftover chickpeas, kind of mixed it in with the tempeh, which I also steamed, because apparently steaming is like reduces some of the bitterness, because if you've had tempeh, ooh, it's an acquired taste, you know? So steamed it, and it definitely like helped with the bitterness. Anyway, toss that in a pan with some roasted chickpeas and some taco seasoning and then i did like lettuce i made my own guac and this goes into my next point sauces i have been neglecting the art of like good sauces with my meals for far too long it's like they're a game changer they really are so i meant to buy mayo and then i couldn't find avocado mayo and then mayo was like six and a half dollars and i was like that's crazy just for like mayonnaise i'm not going to use the whole jar so i mixed greek yogurt which is sort of like similar to sour cream kind of ish with sriracha and use that as kind of like my sauce and it was just spectacular and like i think i'm gonna explore sauces more because i feel like people have this connotation that like vegan or vegetarian food is flavorless and like it definitely can be but also like so can any food but like proper seasoning i've got the seasoning part down it's the sauces that i feel like i've been neglecting uh, my friend and i recently have been watching the harry potter movies which is a franchise i hadn't even dipped my toe into until literally over winter break i don't know why i never read the books never watched the movies as a kid but i definitely was missing out and so i'm excited to and i'm excited to kind of be in the know regarding harry potter now like i feel like that's pretty cool so my goal is to read the book sometime this year but there is such a long line at the library to get them i don't know what is going on or why they don't own like 100 copies of each book but they don't so i'm i'm still in line and the final thing is that i found this pair of real tree camo sweatpants i saw this girl wearing them at a coffee shop and i was like i am so close to asking to buy them off of her I, I didn't even know they existed until i saw them and i haven't stopped thinking about them since but they're so damn expensive but i found a pair on ebay that is ridiculously expensive but i'm considering buying it so i'll keep you guys updated okay i love you bye